We are so excited to be working with Garodia uh, and Finland Way here in Mumbai and in India in general. It has been such a delight to be engaging with the teachers here. We have already been working with them for a very long time, pre-COVID, uh, to make sure that Finland Way can hit the ground running uh, when, the, when the schools opened. So we have been really impressed by the enthusiasm and capability of the teachers here in Garodia. So why is the Finland education system considered the best in the world? We often get asked that. Uh, what is the secret sauce that makes us uh, top all the rankings in education year after year? Children learn all, about, all around the world. They have the same windows of opportunity as they evolve from their birth to their primary years. And what we really emphasize in Finland is to take opportunity in those early years to engage the children through joy and their well-being in their comprehensive learning. So while we are covering all the essential academic learning areas, we also focus on the comprehensive development and well-being of the child. Our approach is uh, something that's called EduCare. So we combine education and care according to the age of the child, appreciating the developmental stage of the child. What is really important is to engage the natural joy and excitement and curiosity involved in effective learning. So it's not about rote learning, it's not about boring repetition or, or just learning to put something on paper that you're told to do. It's about understanding, meaning making, accumulating skills that you can apply in everyday life. Why do you learn to write? Why do you learn to read? So that you can communicate. Why do you learn mathematics? So that you can actively engage in society. You can go to a shop, you can buy things, you can negotiate. So we always think about the practical application in uh, applications in, in Finnish education. But it needs to come through joy and it needs to come through active engagement of the child. And that's where teacher training comes to play. So again, children around the world have this amazing ability to, to learn. But what's really important is that teachers know how to scaffold that learning, how to support that learning at the right time, have an eye out for the windows of opportunity to go in and give just that little bit of extra nudge uh, for them to reach the next level of skill. And I think that's where Finland Way and, and, and Finland are excelling to help teachers start seeing those learning opportunities across all the learning areas and helping children to, to use the skills that they're learning in their everyday interactions and become the agents, the leaders of their own learning. The key differentials in the Finland Way teaching methodology are the so-called three Ps. We are play-based, phenomenon-based, and participation-based. So what does that mean? Play-based is a pretty common term these days, uh, but what does it really mean? It doesn't mean games or, or digital exposure to the children. It means creating playful situations, planned playful situations for the children with the correct resourcing, with an intent and a learning goal in mind. So while the children get naturally into the flow and engaged in joyful play, they start naturally learning. So it's not all about playing chess or, or playing with cards or anything like that. It is really just creating an environment for natural play to take place. And because it's done with intent and purpose, the teacher knows what needs to be achieved through that natural play. And that is uh, by research, the most efficient, natural way and permanent way for children to acquire new skills and acquire new knowledge. So that's the first P, uh, play-based learning, phenomenon-based learning. Phenomenon-based learning means that we don't differentiate between different subject areas. So we don't necessarily do just mathematical skills or literacy, writing, reading skills or maybe music. It means that we choose a theme for learning. So we might choose anything like, say, an apple. We discuss an apple with a child. What can we learn through engaging them with an apple? The shape, the color, 
It's provi uh, providence. Where is it coming from? The apple tree. Where is the apple tree? In a park. What is the function of the park? Does the child enjoy their time in the park? Who does she go there with? What does she like to do there? So you see, you can engage all the different areas of life, bringing them, bringing them to the level of the child, to the realities of the child, and suddenly it all starts making sense. And this is called meaning making. So it happens to also to us grown-ups. If we understand something, if we can contextualize, put something, see something in the context of our everyday lives, we understand it better. So once we start approaching learning areas through relating them to the realities of the child, that is also the most natural way for children to learn anything from geography to geometry to social skills. The third P is participation. And that's very important for us. That means that the children actively participate, that their voice is heard. They have an opinion. They are allowed to have an opinion. They are allowed to discuss, uh, express views, to negotiate again, to settle differences. The child is an active agent in their own learning and in their own life, and later on, and an active participant in, so in society at large. Obviously, we all appreciate that academic achievement is important and that we cover all the learning areas for life and for academic and career success. But it's also very important to make sure that our children are happy and are showing both physical and mental well-being. In, in fact, that is a big priority in Finland way. How do we ensure it? To make sure that there's always joy and the children's voice embedded in everyday act activities in the classroom. We understand the individual likes and dislikes of our children. We create individual learning profiles. We let the children engage, be heard, be empowered in the classroom. The best reward for our teachers in Finland way is to have a confident child where their personality shines through. And that's the root of well-being and the root for creating a foundation for, say, more academic and technical skills. When they have the confidence to make mistakes and learn through them, ask questions and actively engage. Finland Way uses the latest technology to enhance the learning of students in many ways. First of all, we connect with our teachers on a daily basis through our technology platform, making sure that the teachers are following their training program, but also delivering the Finland Way program as it meant to be. We have full transparency of making sure that there is uh, academic and pedagogical excellence happening in the classrooms all over the world, through videos, through pictures, etc. And then our experts in Finland can connect with any Finland Way teacher around the world to help them and mentor them in their professional practice. This is how we can ensure that your child experiences the best educator experience wherever they are. However, what is also very key and very important to the Finland Way experience is the connection between the home and the school. This is why we have a mobile application for parents which is individualized for each child. This means that you can get a tailored profile for your own child and follow their learning and development on a daily basis and get regular reports every couple of weeks where you will get an explanation of the key developments that have taken place over time. You can also communicate with the teachers on the platform if need be. And what is really important, really engage in your child's learning. Often small children don't really tell you what's going on in the classroom or it's very hard to understand what's happened during the day when they get back home. So you can always go back on your mobile application and see the documentation of learning. You, have see, you can see the pictures, uh, the videos of moments of flow, of moments of joy, something that they have enjoyed through the day. And that gives you hints what to discuss with your child how to expand their learning at home, how to expand their vocabulary at home, 
based on the topics that they have covered through the day. This means that learning becomes relevant also at home and the child feels empowered and recognized in what they're doing during the day. And that also improves their motivation, improves their confidence. So with these little help, with this little help from technology, uh, we can make sure that your child's uh, education and learning continues both at school and at home. What's very important is obviously that Finland Way works in the Indian context and we have been made feel very welcome uh, in, in that respect. We are working together to make sure that we are delivering to the goals that you will need in your everyday life and that your children will need to be successful in India and beyond. And together with Garodia, we are doing just that. We are looking at localizing aspects of the teacher training and we are successfully delivering to the local learning goals, both with Garodia's experience and enriching the children's experience with Finland Way. So in Finland Way, the academic skills are of course important, but we focus a lot on so-called 21st century skills. This means ability to negotiate, to work together, uh, to see the big picture, skills that we will need in the future, in the work life, and also in, in personal life. So technology is a very important part of Finland Way. Uh, our parents will have a Finland Way mobile application on their phones where they will be receiving regular updates from the schools. Uh, we have Finland Way schools on four continents and Garodia Finland Way is one of the seven units we have. We started our partnership already during the pandemic uh, when it was all online. And now this is the first time I'm actually visiting the school well, and seeing what a beautiful unit they have. It's been a really nice experience meeting with all the teachers and everyone who we have for now I only met on Zoom. So you can just imagine like how, the, how it feels really great to you know, get to meet the proper personalities and create, create the bond. I've been also very excited about meeting the children. Uh, here they, in Gar at Karodia Finland Way, they are very conversational, they connect with you. Uh, I've heard so many stories about their field trips to parks, uh, how they've seen a snake, uh, about the activities they are doing. Uh, they like to make questions, uh, elaborate the conversation with them. Uh, they're amazing children.